what's up everyone so today I'm gonna to be quickly showing you how to do an insane amount more of melee damage no matter what warframe or what melee weapon you decide to play with so you all may or, or may not have noticed me doing this in previous videos and you probably caught on already to what this video is going to be about but we are going to be talking about Void Radiance. Void Radiance is a focus ability that can be picked up in the Madurai school and when maxed out what this does is that whenever your operator goes into void mode and he leaves void mode a radio blind is activated that blinds enemies within 10 meters for about 5 seconds. Now this ability is one of the most underestimated and overlooked abilities in the game. Now what makes this ability so powerful is that one, enemies take eight times more melee damage when they are blinded and the second thing that makes this really good is that uh, the enemies like unlike other blinds in the game like for example from Excalibur, um, this Void Radiance does not open up the enemies to finishers. Now, some of you might be thinking, like, what, like, isn't that a bad thing? Why would I not want to open them to finishers since finishers do, you know, such high damage, right? So, since Void Radiance does not open up the enemies to finishers, this absolutely makes you destroy massive groups of enemies without pausing to do finishers. Um, keep in mind guys, Warframe is a very fast paced game and a lot of times in the missions you have a bunch of enemies coming at you so pausing to do a finisher that does high damage may look fancy and flashy in the animation but while you're doing that finisher you have a ton of other enemies like shooting you down or shooting your teammates down. Also guys, keep in mind that the cost of this ability is from an energy pool that constantly regenerates quickly. Now, in order for this to be effective, guys, I have found that you need to be fast with this because it involves a, a bit of steps to actually do this. So what's happening here is that you're using transference out, you're then crouching with your operator to go in void mode, and then after you're using transference in, which then releases the operator from void mode, and then the blind comes out. Although you can do this with any Warframe or any melee weapon, I do have to recommend you do this with pole arms that have some kind of reach mod on it. You see the best results from this when you have a long range melee weapon, um, preferably one that can reach as close to 10 meters away from you as possible. Now it may seem like a lot at first guys, but with a little practice, a little patience, this thing becomes second nature. Now I would like to hear other people's opinion on this ability, um, whether you tried it after this video or you tried it before you saw this, please let me know what you think of it. So that is it going to be it for this video guys, I hope some of you found it helpful or informative and I'll see you in the next one.